Yeah, if there's one thing that gets people to give up more than anything else, it's this idea that you need to be perfect all the time. You know, you need to be perfect with your nutrition. You need to be perfect with your exercise. You can't skip a day. You can't, you can't get sick. You know, you can't get injured because that means you failed. That means you have to miss a day. If you eat any form of carbohydrates, if you eat a piece of bread, you fucked up. You ruined it. You weren't perfect. And this all or nothing thinking, this, this myth that perfection is realistic, is achievable, really causes so many people to give up and throw in the towel. Because the idea is, if you're not perfect, you have failed. And that is completely, completely unrealistic and ultimately unachievable. I guarantee you there is nobody, zero people who are 100% perfect, whatever that means, all the time with all their food. And perfect's completely a subjective term as well. There are plenty of people who will eat rice, sweet potato, bread, and have, you know, some ice cream on a particular day, and that will be within their macros, hence that's perfect. Whereas there's other people who eat low, who view low carb or paleo, for example, who eat something with gluten in them, and they've failed, you know? It's, it's, the point I'm getting at is it's completely unachievable to be 100% perfect all the time. Perfection is a myth and I want you to really embody that. I want you to really think about that. And I want you to consider more so, instead of measuring, measuring perfection, I want you to measure, did you do the best you could in that situation? So say for example, you get sick. Did you rest up and did you get back into it when you next could? That's perfect. Are you growing? Another way to look at it is perfection equals growth. Are you growing as a person? If you do happen to make a mistake or slip up, are you learning from it? Instead of giving up, are you looking back, are you reflecting on it and are you learning how to do things differently in the future? Part of making this long term is to understand that you will never be perfect. Nobody is perfect and anyone who says they're perfect is lying to your fucking face, okay? Be okay with mistakes and failure. And if you do make a mistake or a failure or get sick or get injured, reflect on it, learn from it and come back stronger next time around. There's no need to quit. You haven't fucked up. You haven't failed the program. And in fact, you're probably gonna fail somewhat consistently and regularly, and the whole point of making this long-term is just to learn from it.